Where do you guys think money comes from? It's a great question. It came from the olden days. My granddad, because he comes every week and gives me money. Children start to develop their understanding of finance and money actually quite early. But at seven, I think you get this enormous leap when children actually come to realise that money means something. I save up my pocket money more than my brother. I should save my money because I want to help charity. We do see much more of a shyness around women and their investment style because of these sort of early messages that come through things like stories and fairy tales where there is this sense that for young girls, you know, they're waiting for somebody to come and rescue them. Fairy tales are the oldest and most amazing stories that we grow up with and it's really interesting in the 21st century to look at them and see how old-fashioned they are in many, many ways and they do need updating. My name is Emma Dodd and I am the lucky author and illustrator of Fairer Tales. In a land far, far away, three clever women are busy rewriting their own fairy stories. Well, this book, unlike traditional fairy tales, the girls are doing it for themselves. They're not relying on the handsome prince to come and rescue them. Well, HSBC are doing a book to encourage young women to make them understand that they should take control of their own financial futures, that they should have mortgages, that they should understand about investments. For us, it's essential as a bank that both girls and boys, as young children, feel empowered to feel secure and educated in their financial understanding at an early stage. Rapunzel, as she cuts all her hair off, climbs out herself and uh, sets off to become a property developer. If I was a princess, I'd probably save myself. <laughs> By reminding parents that actually this is a conversation they need to be having with both genders, they'll be helping these very, very sort of small messages start to emerge, which is that actually, you know, me and my sister, we could both be quite successful. We hope that parents and teachers come back to us to say we started having easier conversations with children about financial matters. It's intended to make them understand that they can follow their own dreams. I would want to be just like Cinderella. She doesn't give up on her dreams. 